Aloha everyone, my name is Lena and welcome to my channel, Lena Budgets. Here on this channel, we are dedicated to cash stuffings, monthly updates, unstuffings, and mostly all financial um, content. So if you guys are interested in what I do and how I do it, please give this video a like and subscribe. And so today's video is going to be a cash, my first cash stuffing for the month of May. And for this first paycheck, I got in total, let's see here, I got in total paid um, $893.49. Um, so I get three sources of income from uh, one from two from one job sorry <laughs> and another from my side hustle which would be my Etsy business um, so for my job I just work at a local pastry shop I just do the front of the house just the register and um, you know packing cookies and everything um, and so I get my direct deposit and then I do get cash tips as well and then for my side hustle again I just do um, my Etsy business I mostly just do um, like digital downloads. So I do saving challenges and everything. Um, if you guys are interested, you guys can go check that in my description as well. Um, and so for my direct deposit, I got paid $359.95. And then for my tips, I did get paid a little bit extra because of Mother's Day. Um, and then I, I've been working four days instead of three. So I got paid $506 in my tips. And then for my Etsy business, uh, for the past two weeks, I got paid um, uh, $27.54. Um, and so um, I've already counted these and um, I guess you guys are kind of fine with me not counting the money um, just because it, um, it takes up a lot of time. Um, <laughs> when I go and edit the video and then oh I know you guys see it I did get a cash tray <laughs> finally um this cash tray was pretty expensive too I I mean when I originally searched up cash trays I didn't I got like more like cash boxes on um Amazon and um, for you guys, I, for my tips, I don't get to control like the denominations and everything. So I just wanted to let you guys know that um, um, I just get whatever I get. Um, but for my, when I take it out of the bank, of course, I get to control the denominations and everything. So I might have more 20s, more fives, or more ones when I go ahead and stuff the envelopes. So, but I just want to let you guys know. Um, but yeah, but this cash was 30 bucks. Um, and I just took it out of my, my business sinking funds. Um, but it looks so much better. I'm like looking up here at the camera. Oh my God, it, it looks so much better. Um, so uh, we'll, we'll just move the binders to the side first. We're gonna stuff our cash envelopes. And I recently actually just bought new cash envelopes, not these ones. These ones are just my original ones that you guys see all the time. Um, but I, I, and this is my um, my breakdown if you guys are wondering. Um, but I have been watching a lot more videos on like, um, like how like everybody like uses like, um, like a wallet and everything. And, and it's like the A7 size I really wanted to buy one for myself so i did and, and hopefully it'll be coming in like this month for sure um, but for coffee we're gonna do 30 so it's gonna get a 20 a five and then five one one two three four five but as i was saying um i sometimes get flustered when i pay with cash i don't know if it's just me but i kind of get like nervous <laughs> If that makes sense um, so like oh and excuse my nails as well it's kind of gross I haven't had the time to paint them um, miscellaneous is gonna get a 20 but yeah I kind of just get nervous and I don't like pulling out of these envelopes too often it's kind of just difficult for me to just do it and go um, 
Lena is going to get 20 today. Um, but I kind of just wanted something more compact, easy to use and everything. And um, yeah, so I bought an A7 binder. Um, so hopefully it'll be coming in the mail. Um, but for offering, uh, for my tips, it's gonna get 50. So two, four, five. And I, I, I kind of split it up instead of like doing it all. Like, like for this week, it's gonna be $90. I kind of split it up. Um, actually, two, four, five. Um, direct deposit is going to get 36 and Etsy is going to get $3. Um, the reason why I split it that way is for my denominations. Because um, um, the lot 20, 35, 36. Uh, because uh, I did have a problem where um, I kind of did it wrong. And I had to stuff $50 for emergency fund and I had to do it all in fives um, just because I the denomination's a bit weird with you know my, my cash tips and everything but um, and I didn't want to like you know switch it out with like the bank's money I just feel like that's just a waste of time so I just I just do it this way it's just a bit easier um, but in total it should be 90 so that's why um, it's 89 because of um, that's actually like 10% of my whole income. Um, so I just grabbed an extra dollar from there. Um, but um, I just rounded it to an extra dollar just to make it easier. Food is going to get 20. And um, I don't know if you guys saw on my Instagram, but I actually just recently started to meal prep. Um, and so far it's going pretty good. I'm still trying to learn. Um, like what works best for me and my family. Um, and uh, I did make, it was like a, a Thai chicken bowl, I believe that's what it was, but it had like peanut sauce and everything and then just chicken breasts with some broccoli and it was actually, it wasn't too bad. Let me see if I'm in frame, there you go. Yeah, it wasn't too bad. Um, Oh, actually, we're going to start with the saving challenges first. Sorry. We're going to start with the yellow binder. Um, but yeah, it wasn't too bad. Um, I did get like the meal prep boxes from Walmart. And so it's actually been pretty well. Or right, I'm going to be making more um, recipes today. So um, I'll be like posting that on my Instagram if you guys wanted to check that out. Um, but for emergency, it's gonna get a 40 today. And I do have to do a, a bill exchange for bigger bills. Um, so that will probably be another video. Um, so for emergency, it has 1,100, two, four, six, eight, 10, 200, two, four, six, eight, 10, 300, and two, four, six, eight, nine. Oh, 1,390, right? Two, four, six, eight, nine, yeah. One, two, three. And I have to break it down like this, especially for emergency, because I've had a couple times where you guys, um, commented that I counted wrong and I'm pretty sure it's this $1,000 bill that is throwing me off because it looks like a $100 bill um, which is why I count it as a $100 bill in my mind it's kind of weird um, but for retirement it's gonna get a $10 bill today So your retirement has 100, 2, 4, 5, 6, 7, 75, 80, 85. All right. And computer. 
is going to get a 15 and I'm hoping to buy the computer soon, maybe after my graduation. Um, um, so I can, you know, already use it for my business. I'm gonna be focusing a lot more on my business this summer or from now on. And I actually just bought a laminator and I laminated this one. Oh my God, I don't know if you guys can tell, but it's laminated. I laminated it while like, you know, with the coloring because this is probably the only time I'm gonna use this one and then I'll just, you know, check it. Um, but I just wanted to see like how the laminator works and like, um, like how it like, you know, because I've never used one before. Um, so um, I will be having laminated saving challenges starting sometime in June. Um, I'll post more about that on my Etsy. Um, but for computer, I was 100, 200, 350, 70, 90, 100. Wow, it's like 400. Oh my God, wow. Um, 10, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50. Holy shit, 450. That's like four months ahead. I'm trying to have it where I have this is this will be like what I'll use like to get like a month ahead instead of like trying to save two thousand dollars because that's gonna take me a while and I don't know how long it'll take me to save two thousand to just you know like paid in full and everything. Um, but for travel, it's gonna get ten dollars. Travel now has um, two, four, five, six. 65, 75, 85, 95, 100. Oh, 100. That's exciting. Holy shit, right? Oh my gosh. I have $100 in travel. <laughs> That's really cool. Okay. New phone. This is more like the low priority. I'm not really thinking of getting a new phone at the moment, but when I do want to get a new phone, this is what I'll pull from. Um, but it has 10, 20, 5, 35, 40. All right. Father's Day. If you guys can tell, I switched out my Mother's Day um, envelope with Father's Day. And I do have a laminated, uncolored version of what it will look like. So this is what one of my saving challenges that will be coming out um, this summer. Um, so if you guys are interested, please let me know. Um, I'm not too sure when, again, I'll be coming out with them. But it's like a lot like thicker and I really like it because I actually also just bought like sharpies as well because I kind of want to do my videos a bit different where um saving challenges will have its own video so you guys can like watch me color and stuff I always love watching um everybody you know color in and see how their goals are doing and stuff so um that will be fun to watch um, but to start off Father's Day, it's going to get 30. There's like a bunch of paper in here. There you go. That 10 is really flimsy. Okay. Um, future is going to get, let's see, $30 as well. 20 30 and then this one really needs to do a bill exchange as well because it, it's like gonna explode soon. So future has 100, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 200, 2, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 85, 95, 100. Ooh. Oh wow. 5, 10, 5, 10, 15, 16. 17, 18, 19, 21. So 321 for future. And um, I did start this envelope in the beginning of the year. So that would be January. And it is May. 
and we are at $321. Wow. That is the result of slowly putting in as much as you can to stuff what's important to you. Um, but next category is going to be Hualani. She is my cat. Um, she's going to get a 10. So for um, Hua, it, oh, for Hualani, um, she has 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 75, 85, 90. And she is so close to hitting $100 as well. So she can get a $100 bill sometime soon. All right, truck. Um, I'm trying to save for a Tacoma truck. And obviously when I sell my Honda Accord, um, I'll get, you know, the money for it. And that will be used to, you know, pay for my truck as well. But in the meantime, while I am obviously considering, really considering that, okay. Sorry, the video had to cut out. An alarm just went off on my phone of a reminder that I needed to do, um, and it stopped my video. But anyways, um, yeah, when I get a, you know a more serious, um, you know, the income increases a lot um, to know that you know I'll be stable to support myself and paying my truck. Um, I'll use this money as well to help the pay the monthly payments. You know decrease and stuff so um it i put a 30 in here so it now has two four five fifty dollars and i know some of you guys will be really excited to see this next category that i'll be showing a harry styles concert i don't think i need to say anything more about this envelope um i have always wanted <sighs> to go to a Harry Styles concert. I have been a directioner since I was a child. And um, I just, there, I, I don't have to explain more. Um, but my sister also, I'm going to drag my sister to go with me. But the thing is, we live here in Hawaii. The closest concert that, you know, we can go to is in California. Like, it's not like for other people you know you can do like a drive to the closest city that he'll be at you know doing his concert in no like we gotta go to a whole different like area a whole different state and plane tickets and then hotel and uber and that is a whole like it's just it's gonna be crazy but it's a once in a lifetime experience that i think everybody should do um go to your favorite artist experience it love it enjoy it that's what you know i'm planning on doing um but right, we're going to move on to the purple binder christmas is going to get 15. i'm going to try to bulk up this one from now on if you know if i can um because christmas will sneak up on me and then i'm gonna be like oh i wish i stuffed more and so i'm just gonna do i'm gonna stuff more and thank myself later so for christmas it has it has um 20 30 40 50 65 75 85 so it has 85 for christmas really close to Hitting a hundred dollars as well. I don't really think I'm gonna do a bill exchange for Christmas just because I might need the lower denominations um, in the future. Um, real estate is gonna get ten. Uh, I might do it in two fives. Why not? All right. There we go. Real estate has one, two, three, four, five, two, four, five, six, seventy-five, eighty-five. 585. And I am planning to become a real estate agent, so this will just be the fund that I will need for school, my licensing fees and whatnot that I'll probably need. Um, but I need to be 18 to take the test, so I am an October baby. 
Um, so I'm doing just a, we'll call it a gap year, <laughs> even though I'm not really going to school school, but we'll just call it a gap year. Um, but for birthday, it now has, or it got a 10, so we did that in two fives. So it now has 20, 30, 40, 50, 65, 75. And again, I don't know what I want to do for my birthday. I think it's just because it's not that close for me to like, you know, really consider planning on everything, but I should start thinking about what I have in mind so that I can decipher whether I want to stuff more to the envelope or not. Um, but for health, it's going to get a 10. So we'll, again, we'll just do that in two fives. So health now has twin, uh, two, four, six, seven, 85, 90. 90 for health and dentist is next um, I do have to get my wisdoms taken out I haven't made an appointment yet but I know that it's gonna be coming soon um, because my doctors have been looking at them and they're been recommending me to do it pretty soon so um, it's gonna get a 20 today and I'll probably stuff a bit more the next um, cash stuffing because I know that they're kind of expensive and I do want to help you know with paying it and, and stuff so for um, dental it has two four five six seventy all right tattoo is gonna get five dollars again low priority but I have the I have the needs to stuff it at least five dollars. So tattoo has ten, twenty, five, thirty, five, forty. All right. Car maintenance. It's gonna get fifteen. Car maintenance has 100, 250, 70, 80, 90, 100. So it's 310, 25, 35, 45, 55, 60. 360. For car maintenance. And I know that I have to do something that is related to a car registration or something I gotta renew at the DMV um, that will cost a bit of money um, I think it's like $300 or something I forget what it was called um, but I know that I'm gonna have to be doing that sometime this year so good thing I have about like like almost $400 in there um, camp is gonna get 30 oh, that was my last 10 <laughs> okay um, but for those who are still new to my channel, um, camp is a Christian camp that I join my church with every year. So this year's camp is going to be in Maui. Um, and we didn't fundraise because of COVID and everything. So everybody has to pay their own flights. And so um, this is just what I'm saving for right now. Um, but for camp, it has two, four, six, eight, ten, um, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty, sixty, seventy five, eighty. So one eighty. And I'm just guesstimating two hundred dollars. I'm not too sure. My mom's been flying out to Oahu more often for like job purposes. Um, and so I don't think that she'll be able to like use like her Hawaiian miles or Southwest miles to, you know, lower down the prices for the fare. So I'll just do what I can. Um, but for car tinting, it's gonna get its first stuffing. So we're gonna start off with 25. And my sister and friends always make fun of me because I 
apparently am a fishbowl in my Honda Accord, which I agree with them. But personally, I didn't think of anything wrong with it until I was, my mental health wasn't great and I was crying on the way home from work. And I could tell that people were looking at me while I was driving and it was very difficult to try to shield away my tears <laughs> um, from everybody. So I want to tint my car and it gets really hot in there. Holy crap. Like, oh, like even when I put like my sunshade thing on my um, windshield or yeah, it still gets really hot in there. Like I, I can't, I can't deal with it anymore. I, get, I cannot deal with heat anymore. Um, but parents is going to get 15. So um, we'll do it in five. So five, 10, 15. And a lot of you guys are commenting on how um, having a parents category is really smart and I think so too. I mean, I, I don't know who I saw it from, but she, one of like the budgeters I saw on YouTube, she had a parents category and she was at like 1000 and I was like, holy crap, I want to do that. And so I started doing it. <laughs> and I think everybody should, you know, like same thing as emergency. Personally, I really love my parents um, enough to, you know, create a category like, you know, like how parents would do for their kids. I want to do, you know, the same thing. Um, but for parents, it has 20, 30, 40, 5, 55, 65, 75, 85. All right. And I don't have an extra envelope, but um, I have, um, I'm going to create an envelope for taxes. So taxes is going to get 21. Um, so we'll just place it in the back over here. If I can get it in. There you go. Um, but yeah, well, next time, that's my hair. <laughs> next time um, I do a cash stuffing video, there will be an envelope for taxes. So we're going to move on to the green binder. This is my shorter term sinking funds. This is basically what I pull out of every week, you know, for just short, you know, or like small expenses that I do every day. And, um, yeah, so this one is just my shorter term. So we're going to start off with gifts. It's going to get 25 and, um, I did have to get a gift for somebody. So gifts has 25, 30. Um, but as I was saying, I did have to get a gift for somebody and I, actually only had ten dollars in gifts in here and i panicked um and i grabbed from i think it was the target section i grabbed it i grabbed the rest of the um, expenses from because i did go to target for her present um so next time i will stuff more for gifts because i was rarely unprepared for that um so gifts has sorry it has 30 Treats is going to get its usual 20, so it now has 20, 35, 45, 55, 61, 2, 3, 63, and summer is approaching, so I know myself, I'm going to be spending a lot, a lot of money this summer, but I need to learn how to control, like even this morning, I got Starbucks which I was not supposed to do, but I really wanted <laughs> to, so I did. <laughs> um, let's see here, so the next category is gonna be eating out, it's gonna get 40. I do have a dinner that I'm gonna go to on Tuesday. A friend is visiting from New York, um, and so we're, oh, and I, I have another friend, they came from the mainland as well. Um, they're coming home for the summer. Um, but so, you know, we're just going to do a dinner and everything. So I kind of wanted to bulk this up before that happens. Um, so for eating out, it has two, four, 65, 70. I'm really hoping this is going to be enough. I, I'm pretty sure it will be for my portion, but I don't know if the restaurant we go to splits checks, they might just do it all in one check, but that should be enough. <laughs> Clothing, clothing is gonna get off. 
five. I don't know if I should do it in ones. I think I'll just do it in a regular five. So clothing got five. It has five dollars now. And for books, I have no idea what's happening with my nail polish. It keeps chipping really easily right now. Um, Target, oh, sorry, books, I didn't stuff that yet. The books is going to get $5, so it now has 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 26. I don't know why that was so hard. Um, but yeah, I'm actually getting into the book mood lately. I'm currently reading Paris or The Paris Apartment by Lucy Foley. She was the author of The Guest List. I'm pretty sure that was called. I didn't read it. I got it as a gift for somebody. Um, and I don't know if she read it yet. But I've been hearing a lot of people talk about The Paris Apartment and how it's like on their most anticipated books of 2022 and it's it's pretty good it's all right i'm not saying that you know it's it's like wowing or anything and i'm pretty sure a lot of people feel the same about it um but yeah that's currently what i'm reading right now um but for target it got ten dollars so for target we have five ten fifteen twenty twenty five thirty Ugh, i love target I'll, I've said it again and I'll say it again. I love Target. <laughs> Can't change my mind. All right. Beauty is going to get a 20. And I'm today is Sunday. And usually I work Sunday mornings. But I did take off to do a lash. My like lash extensions. But sh my lash tech sadly had to cancel because she got in close contact with somebody for like from covid and everything and so um i was you know super understandable i would rather have good health than like good lashes i told her that um but um i was originally supposed to be stuffing like 60 dollars, but i brought it down to 20 so um blessing in disguise we're able to stuff more categories um but in total beauty has two four sixty um, and then I'm getting a pedicure done for graduation on Thursday. So that's what I'll be using that money for. I just have a bunch of dog hair on my hands. Sorry, guys. I haven't vacuumed and dog hair is just flying around everywhere. Um, Amazon. Let's see. Amazon is going to get $5.00. And I've been really getting into makeup lately. Sorry, um, Amazon has 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. Um, but I've been getting into makeup, like, more into it recently. Um, and um, my collection is expanding and I don't have, like, an organizer. So I'll most likely be using this to go get an, orga an organizer. Um, Fun doesn't have anything, but it's going to get a... 15 so 5 10 15 perfect all right lena budgets i actually just came from target last night so there's like coins that i just threw in here so um we'll put those to the side but uh, and i'll also be putting in I have a bunch of receipts in here as well. Um, I'll also be um, putting my fetch reward code up on the screen right now. So um, if you guys wanted to learn more about it, I do have some information on my Instagram on what fetch is, um, how to use it, how it works. Ooh, I'm so sorry. Um, but my code will be on the screen. Um, for Lena Budgets, um, it's going to get a total of $48, so two, four, oh, okay, yeah, two, four, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, why am I missing a dollar? 
it's probably because I put it in the offering. I'm gonna take that out. <laughs> Uh, I should have just left it at $89. Alright. Should be 48 now. 2, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. There you go. Alright. $80. Or not 80. Oh my god. 48 for Lena budget. So in total it has two, four, five, fifty-five, sixty, five, seventy, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Seventy-eight. Um, and again I recently like went to Target, bought a laminator, bought laminating sheets, and then I got those Sharpies. Um, so I kinda spent like seventy-five dollars in there yesterday. Um, so this will help bring it back up. Um, gas, I am not going to be stuffing it because obviously I, I used all my cash. But I'm not going to be stuffing it right now. I'm going to be doing gas. This is actually a new category. I'm going to be doing gas a bit differently now. But because I go to Costco for gas, they don't like do cash or whatever. It's just, you know, your debit or credit card. Um, but I'm going to budget this time. I'm on half a tank. Um, but I'm going to budget about $40 to $50. Um, usually I budget about $60 because the last time gas prices are about $5 right now, five a gallon. Um, but um, I spent $65, which is crazy. Um, but I know people spend a lot more, so I'm, a, I'm grateful for that. Don't, you know, don't get me wrong. Um, but I'm going to budget about $40 to $50, $50 at max since I'm half tank right now. Um, and the rest that I don't budget for, um, usually I just use it to spend, you know, like on Starbucks or just, you know, free spend that hundred dollar buffer in my account. Um, I'm going to take out that money at an ATM and I'm going to put the rest in this, um, envelope. So, you know, it's a, just a bit smarter that way. If I just need a $20 extra buffer for gas, because, you know, times are tough right now, I will use that category and so um, as of right now I didn't go get gas so I don't have anything to pull out of um, but that's pretty much how the gas category is gonna work from now on um, but that is pretty much it for today's cash stuffing I'm gonna put all these back here um, but yeah that's pretty much it for today's cash stuffing I hope you guys enjoyed today's video um, and I hope you guys are having a great rest of your day um, and happy May and congratulations to those who are graduating this year, um, including myself. I am a graduate of 2022, um, graduating from high school and it's happening this Friday. So of course I'll post more about it on Instagram. Um, but yeah, congratulations to those who are graduating and I hope you guys again have the, a great rest of your day. Happy cash stuffing, happy payday. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Mahalo for watching everybody. And again, have a good day. Bye guys.